Howdy, Possum Patty here. It is August 28th and I am nature journaling after the rain. The first thing that I put on my page was this beautiful Virginia creeper leaf. A Virginia creeper leaf has five leaflets and the one that I saw up the lane had these beautiful red, pink, magenta spots of color on them. I guess this is going to be a preview of their fall color. And now, some news from the mushroom. While outside yesterday, I discovered this very strange looking orange mushroom coming out of an egg. I went out and checked on it again today and I found another one and a few that had already deflated. They don't seem to last very long. I think they're a kind of stinkhorn mushroom. They kind of inflate and then deflate pretty quickly. They pop up out of these little eggs. And one that was deflated, I saw a slug eating it. But by the time I went in, got the camera and came back out, the slug had gone. And this one is quite deflated and a slug was eating it earlier. But we still have all these little eggs here. So maybe some more will pop up. Unless this is a different mushroom. No, I think it's the same because look. This is where the other ones were. And they come out of these little white eggs, these orange fingers. And then I looked over at the log, the big oak log behind where I found this orange mushroom and there were these little yellow fingers sticking out of the log, only on the side where there was no bark. So on this old oak log, you can see these unusual jelly fungi. They're unusual because even though they're a jelly fungus, they look like a club fungus. So anytime after a rain, it's good to look for the mushrooms. But it looked like all these little yellow fingers coming out of the log. And speaking of fingers, another name for this orange mushroom is devil fingers. I couldn't resist. You know, I like to have some whimsy in my nature journal. And just the name Devil's Fingers made me do it. Now the color on this page was done with these wonderful watercolor pencils by Derwent 
This is a large box of them, 36 in this tin. And that's a lot of colors. Using watercolor pencils is fun and easy. Let me just do a really quick demonstration here. I drew a little pair and watercolor pencils gives you the satisfaction of coloring because I love to color. And when you're done coloring, you can play with water. You can do a few layers if you like, or you can layer the colors one on top of each other. I just layered on a few greens, some yellow, some brown. So it's fun to color with them, but then you just take a paintbrush with some clear water and touch it to the colors and they come alive. So if you can color, you can watercolor just by using these watercolor pencils. Hey, look at that. Isn't that fun? So I had a lot of fun doing this page today. And learning about jelly fingers and devil's fingers and enjoying the beginnings of some fall colors. Thanks for coming along today. Happy nature journaling. Bye-bye.